Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Chrishell Siobhan, and today, don't mind my Khaleesi here right now. It's, it's gonna be a look once I get my life together. But today, we're going to do us a rose gold face. I'm going to brunch. We supposed to wear cream. And um, I'm wearing pink too. So, we're going to do us a rose gold face. Y'all know I got my brows on. I feel like I should have done lighter brows, but then it's too late. So, well, yeah, let's start with this here uh, P. Louise base number two. And I'm going to put this all over my eyelid. I have to find a brush to do that. I'm going to probably do this again. Cause I might do a cut crease for y'all today. Since y'all say I never do them, but I don't be wanting to do them. Y'all will cut every crease there is. Looking like birds and peacocks and toucans. Like I'm not into the cut crease thing, y'all. I know y'all like it. And I gotta give y'all what y'all want. But seriously. Okay, looking crazy. So I'm going to use the Saharan Juvia's Place pattern. I said pattern, palette. And we got us some options in here. But in my crease, we don't have a crease option. Hmm. Okay, so this is the, the Nubian palette. And I'm going to take one of these browns. Which brown? What brown? Let's see here. I'm going to take my fluffy crease brush. Bada boom. And we're going to do us. I'm going to mix these two. I'm going to mix this one and this one. And go into my crease. Because I don't want it super dark. But I want bit of color there yeah a little bit of this because it's brunch and it's really sunny and nice today so I ain't trying to go too dark Okay, so I'm going to add a little bit of red to this peach pink red. Yeah, I'm going to do a little bit of the cranberry. And this is in the Watch Me Blush palette. I'm going to do a little teeny, tiny bit in the grease. Back to this uh, Saharan palette. So, I'm going to do the Bororo. Bororo. Uh, you might do a Zoya too. Zoya and Bororo. And first, I'm going to go. I'm going to use my finger for this because I feel like it'll show up better with my finger. 
I'm gonna put the Bororo kinda at the back end of my eyelid, back here. Mm. But that's giving me like orangey, coppery. Gonna be orange. I mean, that's, that's giving me orange vibes. But we could be orange. Okay. And now I'm gonna go into the Zoya. Okay. Maybe if I put some liner on. I'm so damn crazy. Blender. I just spray it with this uh, Tatcha spray. Can y'all? There we go. With this luminous dewy skin mist. Real fancy. But I just spray my beauty blender with this. And today, we gonna mix three of my favorite foundations. So this is the Can't Stop Won't Stop. NYX foundation and this is the shade cappuccino oh it's on the top boom cappuccino right there can you see it bottom on bottom so I'm gonna take one pump of that then I'm gonna do my NARS sheer glow foundation and this is Macau Macau I never know how to say this word but at any rate, we're gonna take one pump of that. And then, I'm gonna do a little pump of my Fenty Pro Filter, and this is the shade 420. And then, I'm gonna take the bottom of a random makeup brush, and just, I'm mixing it all together. And then I just, yeah, mm -hmm. it's real unconventional around here. And then we gonna go to town. want to just bring it down so it could be seamless even if it is like a perfect match bringing it down just makes it work better but uh yeah here you have it i would say these are three medium to full coverage foundations buildable but I'm good with this one go around right here. Bada boom, bada bam. Now, I'm going to wake myself up because I had a long night. And this is the um, 
Fenty Pro Filter Concealer, and I have the shade 390. One dip in this is gonna get you what you need. You don't need to be going back in the pot getting more. Are you good with one? Dip, dip, dip. All right, now let's go to town. I used to be so anti-beauty blenders. I don't know why, but I love this. Like, it's so soothing. Like, I'm not beating on my face. I love it, especially under my eye. Like, it gets the fluid moving and the bags out. Now I go for a natural highlight contour situation. I could get a lighter shade, but uh, I ain't trying to look surprised, okay? Bam. Who was out all night? Nobody. Got some beauty breath. Mm -hmm. It's coming together, y'all. It's coming together. It's coming together. I got on all the wrong stuff for this hair. It's getting caught on my bracelet. I'll keep on be in the way. Okay. So we're going to use this to go blush volume two. Yeah, we're going to get into volume two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm going to do this tie you? Towel? It's not towel because that's not a um, this one. Chow. Y'all got to say these names. It's like a peachy color. Mm-hmm. Hair move. Don't need peach hair too. I love this brush. This is a uh, crack. It's a foundation, but uh it's blush today. It don't look like nothing is. All right. Then I'm going to go over it with this Sola. Because it has a little gleam to it. to light it up. Who do I want to light it up with? Let's do our Juvia's Place Nubia Loose Highlighter.
highlighter. What is this? Angled highlighter brush by Brill Technique. What is oh. So I got my um, what is this? NYX Matte Lip Liner and it is in the color Club Hopper. Oh, I didn't put no setting powder on them. No. Chow. Chow. I'm beaming though. I really want to be glowy and beam today. So I think I'm just gonna put this like in my T-zone. Cause this is what lights up all the time. I put a little bit under my eye. But for the most part. Bada boom, bada bam. There you have it. There you have it. Get this. All right. So, last but not least, mascara and lashes. And then it is time to go. You want to flip your mascara wand when you get to the corner. So you're not running into your nose. Are we going to use today? I think I'm going to go. Let's do the Coco Jet Setter. Right there. Coco Jet Setter. Where's the last blue? so you ain't flying away. And I'm using my duo brush on black glue. Bottom Bottom I'm going to let that get tacky. Another one. to it. And I'm going to put it 
it on. People always ask me why I pull my eye like that, but my lashes curl up, so I have to make sure that I set it on my lash line and not my actual lashes. And I'm real particular about anything on my eye. Everybody stop telling me, don't pull on your eyes. You're gonna stretch them and they're gonna be soggy. Shut up. I know what I'm doing over here, okay? First of all, I'm not pulling it down. Um, I'm, yeah, okay. I got this. And I want my lashes on the lash line. Not on my eyeballs or my eyelids. Where's the other one? Though? <laughs> Heat it up. See that? I put it right on top of my lashes. Some of y'all be looking crazy. One eye be lopsided. One eye lazy eye. One eye snatched. Boom. That is today's look. I'm ready to go eat. I don't look crazy no more. But I, uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thumbs up this video, hit that bell, cause I'm back, okay? And you need to know when I'm chiming in. But uh, yeah, I will see you all later. I gotta go eat. Too late. I see these long fingers. Too late.